Pokemon, a franchise worth billions that we all know and love, created in 1996. In the middle of it, the Pokemon TCG, that started with the base set and that amazing Hollow Charizard. Now, with over 150 sets and counting, Pokemon started taking a dip in the prices and market is also full of uh, these guys. But scalpers are not the only reason Pokemon is losing in popularity. Other TCGs like One Piece are growing fast and people love them. First set came out in 2022 and cards with the main characters of the series are the most wanted cards for fans. Not to mention that the popularity of the cards make the prices go high and strong. Today we are gonna compare the Pillars of Strength, the latest One Piece set with Pokemon 151. Alrighty, so before we start, make sure you smash that like button for me, subscribe if you're new and push that notification bell so you're not gonna miss anything. And here we go. Shall we start with the One Piece card game? This is the newest set that just came out. The rarity of those cards is shown in a bottom corner. The packs are a little bit different. You can feel the, the different kind of texture to the Pokemon, obviously. I don't know if there's any um, any trick to this, so let's just dive into this. Alrighty, that is actually beautiful! Okay, that looks super cool! Super cool! Here we go. I know that there are hollows and like um, hollow patterns on the cards and there are some texture cards here too. Uh, there is a really cool um, Fire Fist Lofi card uh, that I would really like to pull. Look, this is a first holo card, and I'm not gonna lie, the holo looks absolutely beautiful. We have a holo rare, beautiful. Oh wow, that is so cool. And uh, your turn, which I guess it's needed for playing the game. Alrighty, let's just open some Pokemon, guys. Um, I've been quite blessed with 151, um, not gonna lie, my latest streams were really really good, if you missed them you can still watch them online, they are available on my channel and let's go! We have Golduck, we have a Pinsir, a Bills Transfer, Eevee as our first reverse, Ekans as our second reverse and ooh, nice! We have a Blastoise EX guys and a sparkly energy to it! Absolutely gorgeous! Let's go! Since we did not have any super and um, secret rares um, in the One Piece, I guess the Pokemon for now it's winning! Let's go guys! Pack number two of the One Piece game um, I am not intending to keep it any of those cards, so guys, if you are fans of um, One Piece and uh, want, want any of those cards, please do let me know and I will um, send them to you. Why not? Let's see if we can trade, let's see, what, let's, let's see what's gonna happen. DM me if you do like any of these cards. Let's go. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Okay, we have Striker, which is common, but looks absolutely amazing. Ikoku Sovereignty, very interesting. Oh, he's nice to look at. <laughs> we have Django as a holo, and another holo rare, which is Sanji, which is one of the gorgeous, gorgeous um, characters from the One Piece live series, and obviously your turn again. Alrighty, another pack of Pokemon 151. You need to let me know down in the comments down below what do you think about this whole situation with the Pokemon dip in when it comes to the prices. It's really good for us um, collectors, I think. I'm, I'm quite happy um, with this, but I am thinking that Pokemon is losing uh, in popularity due to just One Piece, Lord Kama and other. Um, of the new TCG. Let's go! We have Primate, a Leftovers as our 
reverse and I write you as a hollow rare guys another one piece I kind of like comparing um, other oh this is bad <laughs> um, other TCGs to Pokemon to be honest um, I mean my heart will always be with Pokemon this is terrible <laughs> Um, but I do really enjoy that. I did open a um, Digimon card before, so you can go and check out that video and let's see what we have in this pack, guys. She pretty. <laughs> let's go. I only know the characters from the um, TV series, guys. I am not really, I, I didn't really invest time in watching a, a any of the anime. So let's go. We have Chu. We have. Bokuru. Oh, that is a beautiful hollow, and it's a banyu. Ooh, guys, we have. Oh my god, this is quite cute. Super rare, Marco. Oh my god, the flames and all that looks so cool. And then here we go. So, for now, we have one one if it comes to One Piece and Pokemon. Ah. Oh. You need to let me know who is going to be your winner. Let's go. Another pack of 151. Guys, I went to Cardiff Card Show a um, few weeks ago and I had the best time. I even had the battle with um, Pocky Chloe, with Pocky Dean and um, Vivian and they pulled me some amazing, amazing cards, guys. Um, let me know uh, when is the next time you are going to any shows and maybe I'll join you. Here we go. We have a Weeping Bell, a Poliwag and a beautiful Vaporeon as a Hollow Rare. Okay, another one piece. This few packs really did got me a bit excited. So let's, let's, just, let's just get into this. Jabra. Gaimon, Pearl, Kiwi and Mozu, Hul Dismantler Smash, okay, I guess it's an attack card, uh, Usopp's Pirate Crew, Harata, Top Knot, we have a, that is not a holo, a onesie, a doodle, Ooh, Kaya, a beautiful, beautiful holo rare card. Absolutely beautiful, look at this. The sparkles on it, beautiful. And nice, we have another holo rare, which is Khalifa. Oh, look at this, the whip that she holds. Ah, oh, it's a holo pattern, it's so beautiful. And we have another, your turn. Okay, 151. One. Let me know in the comments down below, did you finish the set? Like lots of people are finishing the 151 set quite swiftly. I did not pull many Charizards, but let's see what's in this pack. PG, we have Hitmonlee, a War Turtle, Hypno, a gorgeous War Turtle as our Reverse Hollow, a Machoke as our Reverse Hollow, and ooh, a Mr. Mime as a Hollow Red. Alrighty guys, let's pack magic for both of those. Let's let's see. Maybe it's gonna be a draw. Maybe it's gonna be a draw. Maybe maybe it, it should be a draw. <laughs> I don't I don't want Pokemon to lose, but on the other hand, I will still be it doesn't change anything for me now. Um I will still be opening a lot of Pokemon. And let me know if you like this kind of comparing series. Uh, I will try to make more of those videos. Alrighty, we have a Thunderbolt. One to Django, uh, Karn, ooh, that's nice, oh, hey, guys, that's a L, that means that it's a leader card, I don't know if this is, that it's not really sparkly, so I'm not sure, we have a hollow rare, a Straussen, Straussen, I guess, and ooh, nice! We have Monkey D. Luffy, um, the main character of the series. People who really watch this and really um, follow whole uh, One Piece probably now cursing Jesus Christ, man. 
<laughs> no, I do not know much. I just watched the uh, Netflix series and that's all. And I'm glad that I pulled Monkey. I might actually keep this card for myself. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Okay, and the last pack of that one, five, one. Let's see what's gonna happen. There's probably like a Charizard in there or something. Here you go guys, there is your code card. Do let me know if you had better pulls than I did. And let's go, we have Slowpoke, a Magmar, a Horsey, Kabuto, Gloom, Clefable, we have Abra as our Reverse Hollow, ooh, a Paras as our second Reverse, and we have a Beedrill as our Hollow Red, so, ooh, I guess it's a draw, guys. Guys, let me know what you think about the whole Rise of One Piece lore comment of the TCG and little dip in the Pokemon. And I will see you next time in Tommy's Dynamax then. Bye guys!